Rebecca Wynn with Devil's Digest here with Brandon McGee. You were one of just 37 linebackers to get invited to the Combine this year. What was that experience like for you? Uh, the experience was big time. I mean, growing up as a kid, you always watch it with my dad and, and how they run 40s and how many people that are stars have been on that 40 line and been invited. So it was a privilege. It was a great uh, way to start my career to the NFL. When you were training for the Combine, you were overcoming an injury. How do you think that affected your performance? Well, I mean, I had this like biotic brace on and I couldn't bend my arm, so I was doing all my running, just it looked pretty funny. I'm happy you guys can see it, but you know, it affects me for six and a half weeks, and you know, I'm loosening up now, I have a faster time today, so I'm happy with it. Um, with your performance at the Combine, how important was today for you, and how important was doing well today? That was really important, because I feel like I hit my 40, and then that's the only thing I saw on Twitter for like the next week, and then the other interviews, 474, and I know I'm way faster than that, so I came out here, four fives, so. I'm having a good day. I'm happy. Um, since you have already been drafted in the in the MLB, how do you think that'll affect your NFL draft? Honestly, I, they the teams will probably take it both ways. They probably ask me if I want to play baseball. Are you focused on football? Some teams might take it like you know he's an athlete. He can play two sports at the D1 level. So you know every team has different opinions, and it only takes one to like me. So I sit and wait. Um, at Arizona State, you've been known as a leader on and off the field. Um, did that get brought up in any of your NFL interviews? And also, how important do you think off-field character is? Oh yeah, they, they brought it up in all the interviews. They asked you if you're a leader, voted by the team, or voted by your teammates, voted by the coaches. And then they, off-field stuff, that's where a lot of people get killed right there, because they know all your background stuff, and if you lie, they go find out bad. So, all my background is clear, so it's all good stuff. Okay, thanks. Thank you. And I'm Rebecca Wynn with Devil's Digest.